Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video, I will show you a game between Zygbert Tarasch and Bernard Richter. This game was played in Germany in 1883. Tarasch had white pieces and he started with e4. Richter played e5. Knight to f3. Knight to c6. Bishop to b5. The Spanish game. Asking the question, Bishop to a4. Knight to f6, attacking the pawn on e4, and now simply d3. d6, knight to c3, g6, intending to fianchet to the bishop. White to move, perhaps castling, looks like a natural move. In this position, white also plays h3, preventing bishop to g4. However, Tarash played d4, threatening d5. Will it work? Because black has b5, preventing the trouble. Bishop to b3, bishop to g4. That is why white plays h3 early. d takes on e5, knight takes on e5. Black is threatening to take on f3 and to damage white's pawn structure. This is the critical moment. How to solve the problem? What would you do in this position if you had white pieces? Are you ready to see the move? Are you sure you are ready? I will show you the move in a slow motion. Knight takes knight on e5. Wow, the queen sacrifice. And it is quite clear that there will be no legal mate because the black knight is on f6. Richter happily captured the queen on d1. Bishop takes on f7 check, king to e7. And like I said, knight to d5 check is not checkmate because of knight on f6. Knight to c6 check was split. Let's take it back. Interestingly, knight to d5 is still okay move. Then, knight takes on d5, bishop takes on d5, and now, if d takes on e5, then bishop to g5 check. And let's take it back, if in this position, king to f6, then, still bishop to g5 check, and after king takes bishop, knight to f7 check. Back to our game. Tarash played knight to c6 check. Perhaps this variation was simpler to calculate. King takes bishop, knight takes queen. Rook takes knight, king takes bishop on d1, b4 intending to win the pawn on e4. Knight to d5, knight takes on e4. Bishop to e3, let's take it back. What's wrong with knight takes on c7? Then knight takes on f2. Back to our game. Bishop to e3. c5. The material is now equal, but from this position, white will be faster in activating his pieces. a3. a5. a takes on b4. a takes on b4. Rook to a7. Invasion. On the 7th rank. King to e6. Knight to f4 is also a good move in this position. Knight to c7 check was played. King to e5. Is the black king safe in the center of the board? With so many pieces still in the game, the black king may not be safe. Do you agree? f3 attacking the knight. Knight to f6. White to move. White play the move, and black resigned, and the move is rook to e1. Richter resigned. I will show you a simple suffering line, which player with the black pieces wanted to avoid. King to f5, and now g4. Check, king to e5, bishop to g5, discovered, check. King to d4, bishop takes, knight, check, king to c4, White to move and to check, mate in one and the move is b3, check, mate. 
What a lovely game. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.